There's a big mystery happening on Oregon beaches. Strange fish with fangs washing up, and biologists not sure why. Imagine strolling along the serene coastline, the salty breeze kissing your cheeks as you marvel at nature's wonders. Waves gently lap against the shore, carrying with them the secrets of the sea. However, amidst the debris left by the tide, an extraordinary sight catches your eye. A colossal tree, seemingly carried from afar by the currents. What could have caused such a massive tree to wash ashore? Join us as we delve into the puzzling phenomenon of massive trees appearing on beaches, bearing horrifying messages carved into their trunks. Number 20. The Neanderthal Footprints Around 100,000 years back, a gathering of Neanderthals, accompanied by lively children, embarked on a leisurely stroll along what we now recognize as the southern coast of Spain. Much like the playful antics of modern-day children in the sand, these young ones were energetically twisting and skipping, leaving behind a trail of footprints that, unknown to them, would one day unveil their tale over a century later. In 2021, the discovery of these ancient footprints at Malas, Kansas in Danana National Park sparked a fascinating journey into the past. New evidence confirms that humans were walking across North America more than 20,000 years ago. Delving into the remnants of these prints were researchers from the University of Helia, whose diligent study revealed intriguing insights into the lives of our ancient ancestors. The footprints, a mix of sizes and depths, hinted at a diverse group comprising children, adolescents, and adults, predominantly young Neanderthals. Through careful analysis, the researchers noticed the playful attitude of these ancient children. Among the 87 Neanderthal footprints unearthed, clusters of smaller prints were spotted in an unsystematic arrangement, suggestive of areas where the youngest members of the group indulged in playful activities or simply lingered along the shore. The tiniest footprints, measuring a mere 5.5 inches in length, were likely imprints left by a six-year-old Neanderthal child. These diminutive tracks not only shed light on the daily lives of Neanderthals, but also hold significant historical value, being considered the oldest known Neanderthal human tracks discovered in Europe. Number 19. The Mysterious Witch Bottles In 2023, residents were astounded to witness the sudden appearance of enigmatic witch bottles washing up on the shores of the Gulf of Mexico. Witch bottles trace back to the troubled 16th and 17th centuries in England, a time fraught with superstition, dread of witchcraft, and the occult. In these fearful times, people sought means to shield themselves from curses and deadly spirits, leading to the creation of witch bottles as a popular defense mechanism. Imagine a small stoneware bottle filled with an array of peculiar items such as nails, pins, urine, hair, and sometimes even a scrap of goat skin. While these contents may seem peculiar to us today, each held symbolic significance in the battle against dark forces back then. You've heard about a message in a bottle washing ashore, but this is harder to explain mysterious bottles plucked from the sea with really strange stuff inside. Some believed that the urine was vital, thought to lure in the evil-minded magic of witches, while others argued that the sharp objects served to spear or harm evil spirits. These witch bottles were often concealed within homes, buried below homes, nestled within walls, or tucked away in other secretive locations, their purpose to continuously work in secrecy to repel evil influences. Although encountering a witch bottle today is a rare occurrence, they occasionally surface during renovations of ancient structures. The practice of witch bottles wasn't confined to England alone. It traveled across the Atlantic with early American settlers, though with slight variations in form and function. Number 18. A massive dragon. Imagine taking a leisurely stroll along the sandy shores, soaking in the refreshing sea breeze, when suddenly your eyes catch sight of an immense dragon skeleton sprawled across the beach. The sheer enormity of this unexpected discovery would undoubtedly send fear down your mind. One can only ponder how many others have been taken aback by stumbling upon this colossal spectacle. However, before you start concocting tales of legendary creatures, it's essential to unravel the truth 
behind this impressive sight. Contrary to what one might imagine, this isn't the outdated remains of a legendary dragon. Rather, it's a carefully crafted art piece, carefully constructed over the course of two months. This dragon, measuring a staggering 40 feet in length and standing at a towering height of 9 feet, is an inspiring creation designed to capture the imagination. Its intricate details and lifelike appearance make it easy to mistake for the genuine article. Yet, its purpose extends beyond mere spectacle. It serves as a promotional tool for an upcoming installment of a television show. While some may argue that it's merely a fabrication, the sheer craftsmanship and attention to detail make it a marvel to behold. Whether real or not, encountering such a magnificent creation in person is an experience that leaves an indelible impression, igniting wonder and fascination in all who behold it. Number 17. The Mari Monster Imagine you're strolling along the shoreline, minding your own business, when suddenly, you stumble upon a sight straight out of a nightmare. Most folks would be utterly startled by what appeared before them. A deformed entity, several feet in length, adorned with long, dark tentacles and encrusted with shells. It's the stuff of monster legends, yet this peculiar creature, discovered in 2016 along the Auckland coast of New Zealand, isn't a creature at all. Dubbed the Mari Monster, due to its monstrous appearance, this enigmatic entity caused quite a stir on the internet when it washed ashore. People couldn't help but speculate wildly about its origins. Some jokingly suggested it might be a Rastafarian whale or an alien time shell. However, the truth behind this strange spectacle was far less sensational. As it turns out, the Mari monster was nothing more than an ordinary piece of driftwood that had become adorned with dragon neck bloodsucker. This marine seafood has a knack for latching onto surfaces like driftwood or rocks in temperate waters worldwide. Interestingly, in certain regions such as Spain and Portugal, these bloodsuckers are prized as delicacies for their delectable flesh. Number 16. The Mysterious Rubber Blocks In the northern reaches of Europe, a puzzling mystery has long captured the imagination of those who dwell nearby. It's known as the Chapati Mystery. Imagine strolling along the shores and stumbling upon strange rubber blocks, each one hidden in mystery and intrigue. This phenomenon has persisted over the years, leaving beachcombers intrigued and scientists scratching their heads from the shores of the United Kingdom to the expanses of France and beyond. The discovery of these peculiar slabs never fails to spark curiosity and amazement among those who chance upon them. But the burning questions remain. Where do they come from, and what in the world is Chapati? At first, rumors abounded. Some speculated that it might be the workings of a curse, or perhaps a secret message dispatched by spies or extraterrestrial beings. However, the truth turned out to be far less sensational. These mysterious objects were not relics of ancient civilizations, nor coded official information from distant worlds. Instead, they were something rather ordinary. The term Chapati traces its origins to a rubber plantation nestled in the verdant landscapes of West Java, Indonesia. Back in the late 19th and early 20th centuries, these blocks were crafted from a substance known as gutta percha, a material relating to rubber that found utility in an array of historical applications, ranging from crafting golf balls to insulating telegraph cables. Number 15. The Elusive Cannibal Fish It's a scaleless fish with a formidable jaw and an impressive size, this unexpected encounter would surely give anyone pause for thought. Such was the case in 2023, when a strange creature washed up lifeless on the Oregon beaches, leaving many baffled as to its origins. This mysterious creature, known as a lancet fish, typically resides in the deep, dark depths of the ocean, far from the prying eyes of humans. With their sleek bodies and fins reminiscent of sails, these creatures are usually found over a mile beneath the ocean's surface, inhabiting the warm waters of tropical and subtropical regions. A big mystery happening on Oregon beaches. Strange fish with fangs washing up, and biologists not sure why. However, they have been known to venture as far north as Alaska's Bering Sea in search of sustenance. What makes their appearance on the shores of Oregon so intriguing is the mystery surrounding it. 
Scientists have yet to pinpoint the exact reason behind these deep sea dwellers being washed ashore. Some speculate that it could be due to their pursuit of prey coming too close to the shoreline, or perhaps they are fleeing from predators. Others suggest that it may be linked to weather or climate patterns in the vast Pacific Ocean. Number 14. The Lady Liz. In 1879, in the bustling shipbuilding town of Sunderland, England, the remarkable Lady Elizabeth came to life under the skilled hands of renowned shipbuilder Robert Thompson, Jr. This grand vessel, constructed of iron and boasting three towering masts, was destined for a life of adventure on the high seas. Weighing in at a substantial 1,155 tons, the Lady Elizabeth began her journey as a diligent cargo carrier, traversing oceans and continents with unwavering resolve. However, Lady Elizabeth's tale took a dramatic turn in 1912 during a fateful voyage from Vancouver to Mossel Bay, laden with precious wood. As she faced the treacherous waters near Cape Horn, a ferocious storm descended upon her, unleashing its fury without mercy. This tempest proved catastrophic, claiming the lives of four brave crew members and wreaking havoc on the ship. The Lady Elizabeth lost her boats and part of her valuable cargo. Her once well-built structure rented asunder by a monstrous six-foot break, while her keel suffered a one-foot breach. Despite her valiant efforts, the Lady Elizabeth limped to the shelter of the Stanley Falkland Islands, seeking refuge and repairs. Yet upon inspection in Stanley, her fate was sealed. She was deemed unfit for further seafaring and condemned to a new existence as a coal shipwreck. Number 13. The Sketchy Lego Man Imagine yourself strolling along the sunny shores of Siesta Key Beach in Florida back in 2011. The gentle waves overtake the sand, the seagulls calling overhead, and suddenly, amidst the typical beach scene, something out of the ordinary catches your eye. A huge Lego figure towering at an impressive eight feet tall and weighing a hefty 100 pounds, made entirely of fiberglass, standing there as if dropped from the sky. What makes this Lego man even more intriguing is the mystery that covers its origin. And it isn't just me that's interested in this. Look, we have SNN6. There's no clear explanation for its presence on the beach that day. No one steps forward to claim responsibility for its creation. All that's discovered is a cryptic message decorated on its t-shirt, No Real Than You Are, along with the enigmatic name Ego Leonard. Initially, speculations run wild. Some speculate it to be a clever marketing ploy organized by Legoland, capitalizing on the love for all things Lego. But as the layers of this peculiar puzzle unravel, it becomes apparent that this isn't your typical publicity stunt. Instead, it's an art installation a stroke of brilliance from a mysterious artist hiding behind the nickname of Ego Leonard. Number 12. The Sea Dragon In 2021, while carrying out the routine draining and maintenance of a lagoon at the Rutland Water Nature Reserve, Joe Davis, a leader of the conservation team, stumbled upon an extraordinary find. He unearthed the old-fashioned remains of a marine reptile, popularly known as a sea dragon. This discovery was not just remarkable, but revolutionary. This particular remnant turned out to be a true marvel, being not only rare, but also the largest and most intact marine reptile skeleton ever discovered in Britain. Estimated to be over 180 million years old and stretching over 32 feet in length, it ranks among the oldest and grandest remains of its kind ever seen. What's more, its completeness astonished researchers, as it included a nearby complete skeleton an uncommon occurrence for such massive prehistoric creatures. For those unfamiliar, creatures were marine reptiles that coexisted with the dinosaurs, appearing around 250 million years ago. They were the top shark of the Jurassic Oceans, reaching lengths of up to 25 meters and sporting numerous razor-sharp teeth. The Rutland discovery, believed to be a cutting-tooth lizard triangle, underwent careful excavation by a team comprising both expert and amateur archaeologists. This process involved a sophisticated operation of uncovering, documenting, and safely collecting the specimen. Today, scientists are fervently delving into the mysteries surrounding these ancient sea monsters that
that once reigned supreme in our oceans. Number 11. The Giant Plastic Pipes Enormous plastic tubes, much larger than anyone could have imagined, found themselves unexpectedly scattered along the English coastline in a peculiar maritime incident back in 2017. These weren't just any ordinary tubes, they were huge, some stretching as long as a jaw-dropping 1,500 feet and towering up to a staggering 8 feet in diameter. Their arrival caused quite a stir among beachgoers in Norfolk. Remarkably, the mystery surrounding their origin was quickly unraveled. Initially destined for a construction project in Algeria, these mammoth pipes were being towed from Norway. However, fate had other plans, a twist of fate. Reminiscent of a tale from the high seas, intervened when a container ship collided with the towing vessel, setting these extremely large pipes adrift on an unforeseen journey towards the English coast. The pipes made landfall at various locations, dotting the shores of Echo on Sea, Sea Palling, and Winterton. Despite their imposing size, authorities assured the public that they posed neither danger nor risk of pollution. However, their sheer spectacle attracted a considerable amount of attention, especially from curious children who couldn't resist the allure of such an unusual playground. The operation to recover these massive tubes was no small feat. It involved securing them at a single offshore location before embarking on the unsettling task of towing them back to their intended destination in Norway. Number 10. The Garfield Phones Have you ever imagined stumbling upon a treasure trove of Garfield-themed novelties while strolling along the sunny beaches of Brittany, France? Imagine walking along the sandy shorelines. You come across peculiar finds washed ashore, not seashells or driftwood, but remnants of Garfield phones. These iconic phones are adorned with the image of everyone's favorite spaghetti. For more than three decades, locals have been amazed by the steady appearance of these Garfield-themed relics. Imagine the excitement of stumbling upon pieces of these phones, coiled cords, receivers, and the unmistakable light heads sporting Garfield's characteristic mouth. These discoveries have left beach cleaners and environmentalists scratching their heads, pondering the origins of these whimsical artifacts. The mystery surrounding these Garfield phones deepened as concerns arose about their environmental impact. There were fears that these plastic remnants might have originated from a lost shipping container, potentially endangering marine life and polluting the fresh ocean ecosystem. The quest to unveil the truth behind these weird beach discoveries became a matter of urgency for environmental activists. However, the mystery took an unexpected turn when a local farmer named Rene Marvin provided a crucial clue. Recalling an encounter decades earlier, he revealed stumbling upon a hidden sea cave filled with a trove of Garfield phones following a powerful storm in the mid-1980s. Number 9. The Cursed Melon Discovering a melon while strolling along the sandy shores is a pretty ordinary occurrence. But imagine stumbling upon a melon that seems to carry a mysterious atmosphere, sending chills down your mind. This unusual scenario happened in the United Arab Emirates back in 2016, when a seemingly innocent melon washed ashore, capturing the curiosity of beachgoers and locals alike. Imagine a simple melon causing quite a stir among the coastal dwellers. What made this fruit so extraordinary? It wasn't its taste or size but rather the strange markings that adorned its surface. These markings were not your run-of-the-mill blemishes. They were believed to possess spiritual significance, sparking fear and speculation among those who encountered it. To make matters even more perplexing, the melon was said to be adorned with pins and nails, as if someone had attempted to pierce it with dark intentions. And etched into its flesh were strange symbols, resembling ancient poetry or spiritual symbols. Locals couldn't help but feel a sense of unease at the sight of this bizarre fruit. Fearing the potential evil-minded influence of the cursed melon, authorities were alerted and clerics were summoned to perform rituals to cleanse it of any supposed dark magic. With great caution, the melon was carefully dissected, its nails removed, and its cryptic symbols carefully erased. 
all in an effort to ensure the safety of those who had unwittingly stumbled upon it. Number 8. The 200-Ton Long Tanker In May 2016, locals strolling along the coastline of West Africa stumbled upon an extraordinary sight. A huge oil tanker, measuring a whopping 200 tons, stranded on the shore. This wasn't your typical maritime difficulty. It was a perplexing discovery. The tanker, later identified as the Taya One, had been swept ashore, presenting a puzzling mystery to those who encountered it. Normally, ships and tankers can find themselves stranded due to various reasons, but the circumstances surrounding this 206-ton oil tanker were far from ordinary. Found deserted on a beach in Robert's Port, Liberia, the absence of any crew members was conspicuous. The vessel had departed from Panama and was last observed far away from notorious pirate-infested waters. Naturally, theories abound regarding the abandonment, ranging from financial woes of the vessel's owner to unpaid crew members. However, the Liberian Maritime Authority could only speculate, as the true cause remained hidden in mystery. Adding to the intrigue was evidence of a fire discovered in the captain's quarters. This raised suspicions of foul play, suggesting that more frightening forces might have been at work. Number 7. The Shocking Megalodon Tooth The Megalodon, a huge shark that once dominated the seas, continues to capture the imagination, even though it has been extinct for over three million years. This ancient predator, often represented as a gigantic version of today's great white shark, is primarily known for its outdated teeth. Some speculate that it might still lurk in the unexplored depths of the ocean, but this idea clashes with what we understand about the specialized adaptations necessary for deep-sea life. Evidence from remnant records suggests that the megalodon preferred shallow coastal waters, much like its modern counterpart, the Great White Shark. While the exact reasons for its extinction remain uncertain, changes in ocean temperatures, shifts in food availability, and competition from emerging species like the Great White are believed to have played roles. Despite scientific consensus on its extinction, many cling to the belief that the megalodon still exists, hidden in the ocean's depths. This persistent intrigue adds an extra layer of fascination to each discovery related to the megalodon. Finally tonight, a nine-year-old Maryland girl's curiosity leads to an amazing discovery 15 million years in the making. In 2022, excitement rippled through the local community of Maryland when a 99-year-old girl stumbled upon a 5-inch megalodon tooth. What made this discovery even more remarkable was the timing. It occurred on Christmas Day. Number 6. The Horrific Metal Seats In 2023, beach enthusiasts were confused when they stumbled upon a peculiar sight along the shores of a New Jersey beach, specifically in Margate. What caught their eye were these mysterious metal seats sitting amidst the sands seemingly out of place, yet strangely captivating. The unexpected discovery sparked a frenzy of speculation and theories, particularly online, where imaginations ran wild. With these rusty seats lacking any cushions, seat belts, or buckles, people couldn't help but conjure up fantastical explanations. Some even entertained the dramatic idea that they could be remnants of a tragic airplane crash, adding an air of mystery to the scene. However, as it often happens, reality proved to be less sensational. The Margate Police Department took matters into their own hands, conducting a thorough investigation to unravel the mystery. Eventually, they debunked the airplane crash theory. Instead, it was revealed that these seats likely hailed from a retired subway or train car. So how did these seats end up on the beach? The culprit was identified as strong storms which probably dislodged them from their original birth. Number five, the giant driftwood. Imagine you're strolling along the beach and suddenly you spot something huge. It's not just any driftwood. It's a mammoth tree washed ashore from the depths of the ocean. This isn't your ordinary beach find. Towering over everything, it commands attention, leaving you feeling tiny in comparison. Standing next to it, a person appears tiny, almost like a dot against the vastness of the tree. Nonetheless, the tree is undeniably massive, 
boasting a diameter ranging from 5 to 10 feet. It's the kind of sight that begs to be captured in photographs, a true marvel of nature. However, as fascinating as it is, there's a downside. Trees of this size take ages to decompose naturally, so it falls on the local authorities to deal with the cleanup. But amidst the routine, something extraordinary happened. A woman stumbled upon this extremely large tree, and to her amazement, she noticed something peculiar carved onto its trunk. It resembled ancient symbols and signs, unlike any known language. Before she could examine it closer or document it, the tree vanished as if swallowed by the sea once more. Number 4. The Blob on the Sandy Shores On the sun-kissed shores of Western Australia, beach enthusiasts found themselves in a state of bewilderment when they stumbled upon an enigmatic creature back in 2023. This creature, affectionately termed the Blob, turned out to be a coffin ray, also known as a numbfish. Its unique appearance baffled onlookers. It boasted a pear-like shape, highlighted by an unusually enlarged intimate fin disc and a remarkably short tail. Yet, the astonishment didn't end with its appearance alone. These rays possessed a remarkable ability, electric organs capable of generating a staggering 20,000 volts of electricity. This shocking feature served both as a means of hunting and self-defense. Widespread to the waters of Australia, these creatures favored sandy or muddy seabed near the shores and creeks. Despite their electrifying capabilities, identifying these creatures wasn't too challenging. Their distinct, almost comical appearance, resembling a flat blob with a miniature tail, made them stand out. They seemed more related to pancakes than predators, yet beneath their whimsical exterior lay a potent defense mechanism. Number 3. The Ancient Walrus Skull In 2011, Fortune smiled upon young Forrest Shepard during a leisurely stroll along a beach near Santa Cruz, California. At just 13 years old, Forrest's fascination with fossils and archaeology led him to an extraordinary discovery. A complete skull of a previously unknown species of walrus dating back 5 million years nestled within a massive rock. A curious teenager wandering the coastline when suddenly he stumbles upon a treasure trove of history. The outdated skull, weighing approximately 70 pounds with its rocky enclosure, was astonishingly well-preserved. Forrest, recognizing the significance of his find, knew he had stumbled upon something truly remarkable. With the assistance of a friend, Forrest managed to transport the hefty specimen back to his family's car. Little did he know, this chance discovery would rewrite scientific textbooks. Years later, Detailed analysis unveiled the true magnitude of Forrest's contribution to prehistory. The remains he unearthed were not just any walrus, it was an entirely new species. In a heartfelt tribute to Forrest's accidental find, scientists bestowed upon this ancient walrus species the name Venus Shepherd Eye. This name immortalized Forrest's role in unveiling a piece of prehistoric life. Venus Shepherd Eye stands as a proof of adaptation and evolution. Its distinctive features, notably a toothless skull save for its impressive tusks, suggest a specialized feeding strategy, perhaps even more refined than that of modern-day walruses. His story reminds us that sometimes, amidst the retreat and flow of life, remarkable discoveries await those with a keen eye and a curious spirit. It's a tale of chance, curiosity, and the profound impact one individual can have on our understanding of the world. So as we marvel at Forrest's extraordinary journey, let's also celebrate the spirit of exploration and discovery that drives us all. Number 2. The Enigmatic Seaside Spectacle In the year 2007, inhabitants of two small Dutch islands in the North Sea were treated to an extraordinary scene along their familiar shoreline. Imagine thousands upon thousands of unripe bananas strewn across the beach. Quite an odd sight indeed, wouldn't you agree? One wouldn't typically associate bananas with the vast expanse of the ocean. But there they were, adorning the sands like a vibrant carpet. The cause of this peculiar phenomenon? A cargo ship, succumbing to the ferocity of a storm, 
spilled its cargo of bananas into the sea, which were then washed ashore. Imagine the surprise of the islanders as they stumbled upon this unexpected bounty during their daily strolls along the coast. The beach became a bustling place of activity as locals flocked to collect these precious yellow fruits. It was a sight to behold, as people of all ages eagerly gathered their share of the bananas, turning an ordinary day into an impromptu beachside treasure hunt. Even those who weren't particularly fond of bananas couldn't resist joining in the excitement and merriment that filled the air. Number 1. The Monstrous Football Fish Imagine stumbling upon a creature that seems like it's from another world, with monstrous features that make you question what you're seeing. Well, what if I told you about the football fish? Quite the monstrous creature, isn't it? It's not an alien invader, but rather a fascinating creature known as the football fish, or more commonly, an anglerfish. Recently, beachgoers in California were astounded when they stumbled upon the remains of this peculiar creature. Usually, these football fish reside deep in the ocean, far beyond where sunlight penetrates, around 3,000 feet below the surface. So, finding them washed ashore is quite unusual and surprising. The Pacific football fish is a type of anglerfish, characterized by its jet-black appearance, gelatinous body, rough spikes, and tiny eyes. But what really sets it apart is its massive mouth, lined with needle-like teeth and a light emitted by living organisms from its head, resembling a fishing rod with a glowing bulb at the end. What's even more intriguing is their peculiar mating behavior. Only the female Pacific football fish possess these qualities and can grow up to a whopping 24 inches, while the males are significantly smaller, reaching only about one inch. Why such a stark difference, you may ask? Well, it turns out the males are considered parasites. They clip onto the females and eventually fuse to them, leaving only their reproductive organs behind to mate. A single female can carry several male anglerfish on her body. We might be wondering why these creatures end up on the shore. It's quite a mystery, considering how rare it is to observe them in their natural habitat. Each football fish provides scientists with a valuable opportunity for study, shedding light on the secrets of the deep sea. However, the reason behind why several of these specimens ended up ashore remains elusive, adding another layer of intrigue to these already fascinating creatures. Which one of these finds in the massive tree washed ashore and carved warning message on the trunk do you find intriguing? Share your thoughts and comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more.